Hey, as many of you out there know, I'm doing a little uh, fundraiser right now for Fur Friends Animal Rescue. I am allowing people to donate $10 or more every day to Fur Friends Animal Rescue. And then out of the people that donate each day, I'm giving away 10 of my Glock Perfection patches. Uh, and I'm giving them away because I can't sell them. So like I said, these are going to be very limited, very rare. Can't make any more because of a cease and desist letter. Well, I decided yesterday that if I'm doing this, I should probably let... For a friend's animal rescue, no, because I had realized I had not said anything to them yet. So I sent them a text message yesterday, letting them know what I'm doing, and she sent me a text message back saying, this is perfect timing. Because before, I didn't know that this was going to be for anything specific. I just thought it was going to be a general fundraiser for them. But right now, she said, this is perfect timing because they are trying to rescue eight Parvo puppies. Now, I know that's not their breed. These puppies were born with Parvo. Now, for those of you that don't know, parvo is a fatal disease for dogs. But with proper treatment, which can be a little expensive because it requires lots of fluids and etc., cetera, 90% uh, survival rate. They go on to be completely clean. It is completely curable. It just takes time, effort, and unfortunately, money. So she's going to use the money from this to help rescue those eight parvo puppies. So now our fundraiser has a face. In fact, it has eight pretty little faces here, uh, especially this one. Look at this one. Isn't that not cute? Uh, and this one, this one's adorable. But you know, if I was going to take one of these, they're all adorable. But if I was going to take one of these puppies here, it'd probably be this puppy because for some reason, this puppy's looking at the camera like, yeah, I got Parvo. What of it? You know, it just, I like that puppy's attitude. So uh, like I said, now though, our fundraiser has a face and a, a mission. We are going to rescue these eight Parvo puppies. Now, a lot of, uh, shelters, etc. If a puppy has parvo, they just put them down because they have limited resources. And that's the sad truth. Uh, and a lot of people out there probably be like, why bother trying to save puppies that have parvo? Well, I hate to break it to you. I'm a kind of person, uh, there's a lot of people in this world, like human beings that I am aware of, that if I was walking down the street and someone on the other side of the street was beating them to death with a frozen mackerel, I wouldn't cross the street to stop them. Uh, but I have never met a puppy in need that I didn't think wasn't worth saving. So I'm a firm believer of help every puppy. If you ignore one to help another, then you're really not doing the best you can do. Uh, just the way I feel about it. So uh, I want these puppies to all survive. And if it means only eight of them or only seven of the eight survive, it was worth it. So uh, this is what we're doing it for now. So if you want to go over to TYMP Pistol Project and donate today to be in the running for the 10 patches to be given away today, like I said, just go over to TYMPPistolProject.com. There'll be a link in the upper corner of this video. Go to that little splash page. There'll be a little pop-up. And you just click on that, go over, donate $10 or more. You're automatically registered. Or if you don't have the pop-up, if you've got pop-up blocker or something, there's a little window right in the middle that you can donate through. Like I said, $10 or more gets you in the running for today's drawing. Now, if you want to be registered for tomorrow's drawing, you have to donate tomorrow. But uh, donating today will get you registered for today's drawing. And like I say, right now, we've been running about 50%, just under 50% right now, of the people that donate get a patch. Uh, and it's probably more than that of people who donate because some people donated multiple days until they won. But of the people who donate, donate on a certain day, we've been running about 20 to 22 donations a day and I'm giving away 10 patches. So that's not bad. Uh, not bad odds actually. And plus it's not about the patch to be honestly, it's about saving the puppies. So if you want to be registered to win the patch, go on over to tympistolproject.com, donate $10 or more. And with that being said, it's time to uh, announce yesterday's winners. And uh, I had to write this out by hand today, so I'm hoping I'll be able to read my own handwriting here. But uh, I wrote it like really fast as I was selecting names at random, because uh, I use a random generator thing to select random numbers and the lines are numbered. So today's winners are <clears throat> uh, Stephen, I don't know if that's Angel or Angle, but Stephen Angel Angle. Uh, this one, I'm pretty sure, is not the person's real name. Uh, computers Dude. Dude. Uh, dude. I, don't, I hate that word for some reason. I don't know. I use it all the freaking time, but I hate it. Uh, man was when I was a kid. That was what was popular. Hey, man. That's what was popular. Now it's dude. My kids call everybody freaking dude. Oh, I don't know why I'm ranting about that. Uh, Tim. 
I don't know, it looks like falafel to me, but it's Fasumalgi. I'm sure you know that's you. Uh, Andrew Hefker. Uh, Benjamin Alby. Uh, Jeff Patterson. I wonder if you're in relation to Pat Patterson. Uh, you know, WWE Pat Patterson, Mr. Feely Hands of the WWE world. Uh, or Uncle Feely Hands, I'm sure, as they like to call him. Uh, Matthew McLuggage. That's a weird name. Sounds like you bought your suitcase at McDonald's. Uh, David Wendy. Everyone knows it's Wendy. I wonder how many people in here are old enough to get that reference. Everyone knows it's Wendy. Uh, Sarah Kashmarisky, Kazmarowski, some Russian name. Uh, another woman. That's surprising. Another woman. Uh, women don't watch my channel. I don't know. What's, uh, although I would bet with that last name, that's probably not really a woman. That's probably an old Russian man dressed as a woman to infiltrate our government or whatever. I don't know what they're over here doing. Uh, but I wouldn't try. I keep an eye on them. I bet she has to shave a lot. Uh, and finally, Joseph Chu. So those are the 10 winners from yesterday, which was the second, which was also Every Second Matters Day. But uh, so those are the winners from yesterday. Uh, if you are one of the chosen winners, send me an email with the subject line of Perfection Patch. And in it, just type your address. Not a paragraph that has your address in it somewhere. Just your address, like you were filling it out on a return envelope or something. So go ahead and do that. We'll get the patches out to you ASAP. Probably be at the end of this thing. I don't know if I don't know if G Webs is going to mail them as I give them to him, or if he's going to wait till the very end to mail them. But either way, it ends on the eighth, so it's only like five days away. So not a big difference. So those are the ten winners for yesterday. If you want to be registered to be a winner for today, or you just want to help these adorable little puppies uh, for that, uh, so and you want to go over and donate to Fur Friends Animal Rescue just to save the puppies, uh, that's great. But you also get a chance to win a patch. So if you want to be in the running for today's patches, go on over and donate before midnight tonight. <laughs>